On December 16, 2015, astronomers notice an unusual pattern in the light coming from a star in the Ophiuchus constellation. To verify the discovery, they measured tiny movements of the star, known as the Doppler shift. When we talk about measuring the Doppler shift of a star, what we're talking about really is a planet pulling on the star as it orbits, and the star moves back and forth. The bigger the planet, the more that star is going to move. The measurements reveal something intriguing. The star's Doppler shift shows it is being pulled, not by one planet, but by three. It turns out that one of these planets is in the habitable zone, the Goldilocks zone, and that's what makes this particular discovery so exciting from the prospect of finding life. The world bears all the hallmarks of a planet capable of supporting life. But there is something strange about it. It doesn't spin. That means that one side of the planet will get really hot, the side that's facing the star, and the other side of the planet will be really cold. You'd have very strong winds that are blowing from the hotter side to the cooler side. There would be tornadoes, there would be windstorms whipping around, and it would be very violent. The star has a massive gravitational force, which has stopped the planet from spinning. Scientists call the phenomenon tidal locking. To be tidally locked, one side of the planet always faces the star, and one side always faces away into deep outer space. Same situation with the moon facing the Earth. The planet's light side is too hot for even the toughest life forms to survive. The dark side is impossibly cold. But there is one slim area of this world where life is possible. This twilight zone area, the sky would be a peachy color. The sun would never rise, it would never set. And yet here is where all the action would be. The planet's powerful gravity could have a dramatic effect on living creatures. Wolf 1061c is more than four times more massive than the Earth. That means that the gravity is gonna be twice as strong. If there are creatures that can walk around, they probably are very short and have big fat legs to move around under that high gravity. The twilight world is only one of many potentially habitable planets so far discovered by NASA telescopes.